Alright yo, what is going on guys, Flamebreaker here, and welcome back to BeamNG Drive. Now today, as you might be able to see, there has been a new update. And I feel like the graphics have been updated a lot, and there's new locations on this map. So, we we'll might have to check those out in a later episode, but for today, we're going to be focusing on this, the Force Field. So, obviously, it's activated now, and it can push cars away from you. So, uh, I don't know. Oh, crap. Um, okay, well, either way, we're going to be doing some experiments with this thing today. Um, so I guess we're not going to be running a car straight into it, but on the one that we can do it on the other, the other way. I was planning on having the Chevetta, or the car run into this but that's fine we're gonna see what happens if we run into it in the bow line with the force field on so here we go uh three two oh, no, no. My, sorry my pc is insanely laggy oh here we go three no, three two one go i meant to hold the e-brake but whatever here we go So the car should be right up there, or you can barely see it up there. Okay, here we go. Let's see what happens. I'll ram into it. Here we go. What's gonna happen? Oh! Oh! Wait, what's the force going on? Oh, oh, oops, I just hit fire. Okay, um... Yeah, so... I guess the force field doesn't protect against everything. Uh, I did accidentally hit fire, but that's my bad. Uh, I gotta extinguish that real quick. Hold on a second. Uh, extinguish. Here we go. I should be thinking all cars. We should have like a coolant system that does that. But, oh gosh. This thing is pretty wrecked. Uh, uh, it probably still runs. It still runs. Okay, well. This was only the first experiment, it didn't even... I was planning on do, driving this car into the bow line, see what happens, but... Let's just move on to the next experiment. Alright, so the next test is missiles. See if this thing can withstand missiles. I do need to see real quick if, I, if this thing can even... Okay, yeah, we got some pretty bad range. I'm gonna have to go up a little bit closer. Okay, just a second. Right about here should be good. Here, I'll try it. Oh. Okay, maybe a little bit closer. Don't stop going in reverse. Okay, and now. Oh, oops. Okay. Um, technical difficulties, I'm sorry. Hey, uh, but we will get this right. Here we go, that's a hit. Solid hit. Okay. This should be good. But nevertheless, I just want to see what happens if we turn this on. I'm going to see if I can't pause it right when I launch the missile. So I'm going to launch all of them at once. Let's try to do TGHY. Those are the controls. And... Okay, pause. Is that gonna hit? That may hit, okay. So I'm gonna shift over to this car. Fun stuff. Force field, here we go. And now, activate. It didn't work. What? Wait, what? That just... Does it even work to begin with? Yeah, it, it works, but like... I wouldn't really call this a force field, it's not really protecting anything. 
Hey, you know, I'm, I'm gonna drive over it. I'm, I'm gonna straight up run it over. Because that's how I'm gonna do it. What? Wait, hold on. It's pushing me back. It, it's not even pushing me back. Oh, no. I forgot this. I forgot it turns off. Okay, well. Let's move on to the next experiment. So far, this thing is becoming pretty disappointing. Not gonna lie. Alright. Now, as you can see, I have a gun. So I can. I have this tentacle hole with a gun on it. So. If I hit this button. Yeah, there we go. It's shooting bullets. And I should be able to. Is this actually working? Is this actually hitting? I don't know if this is working or not. How do I, how do I aim it down? Um, I don't know how to aim down. Uh, l let me get the original gun and see what happens. Alright, now we have this cute little gun. We can move up, down, potentially side to side. Here we go. So this ordinarily do some damage. As you can see, as it's completely demolishing this little car. Oh, oh gosh. Yeah, okay, so we're going to see if this works with the force field on. I don't know how I'm going to time this, but here we go. So, actually, no, I can't do it now. Okay, so I'm going to go to this. I'm going to start shooting. Where is the sweet spot? Okay. So now it should still be shooting. Um, and now force field? Now, I'm Uh, I don't think it did anything. I don't really know how to tell, because the bullets move so fast. Huh. I'm gonna say it does There's no really any re real re way to tell. Um... That's fine, though. Uh, let's just move to the car jump arena for the final experiments. Okay, so now, after a long time of setting this up, we're going to do a test. We're at the car jump arena, and we're going to see if the force field can push a semi-truck that I have put down the ring. Don't slant it, but we're going to see if this will work. Here we go. Okay. Um, well, there goes the truck. Um, it's sent it to the sun. Um, I want to try that going slow. I'll try that going slow and see what happens. Okay, so we're coming up on it. The force field is activated. Will this push the semi away? Uh, okay, it did it for a little bit. There was a small period. Um, okay. Let's see what happens if we use a different vehicle. Now, now here we have a bank truck. It's still kind of slanted, but it, it's fine. So the force field it is going to be activated. It's probably not since I switched to the other car. Is it on? No, it is not on. Okay. Force field activated. Let's go. This video is going to turn into me smashing cars into uh, this owl car into a tr van or cars. Here we go. Here we go. This is perfect. Not perfect, but it's fine. There's the van. Here we go. Here we go. Please block. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. 
Um. Okay, well that was insane. We're, we're gonna make it all the way to the bottom. Um. Okay. Um. You know, I have one more car in mind to replace this car right here. But just the end of the episode, we might as well break it out when we grab it. Yes, the flying bus is back. And you know what? I'm going to give this thing in. I'm going to name it Maverick. So it's like the dude from Top Gun. But here we go. Just for funsies, we're going to turn the force field. Oh, jeez. I already. It's already rolling. Okay. I'm going to turn the force field on this thing. And we're going to see if this can break through to the. Like, if this is going to push back the band. It's probably not going to work, but for funsies, we're going to do it anyway. Here we go down the Jados. Let's go, Maverick. Uh, if you guys have any better names, comment below, but for now, Maverick is the name. I, I, don't, I don't think I'm going to change it. I'm going to leave it with Maverick. Uh, oh, wait. I hope he doesn't take off before we ram into the, the van. Here we go. What's going to happen? I'm very curious. We're over 200 miles an hour now. <laughs> what was that sound? Okay, I heard something. Some sort of weird sound. I'm going to have to go over the footage again. That was just... Oh my gosh. It's a part of the... Okay, hold on. I'm turning Jado's off. I heard some sort of weird sound. There's the... I'm guessing a Jado. Uh, Maverick is in need of a repair. Oh my gosh. Okay, well... That was quite a banging way to end up the episode, but I'm going to end off here. If you guys want to see more of this game in the future, make sure to like, subscribe, and give me ideas. I need some ideas for this game. But without further ado, I'll see you guys next time. Deuces.